hi guys so ignore my hair right now so i just need to say something um i need to talk to this generation to my youngins my 15 year olds 14 year olds um i know that you guys love playing around and joking around and you guys think it's funny to like joke around about like dark stuff about the dead and you guys are very interested i know because i myself like was like that when i was younger i was very interested in like supernatural phenomena like dark stuff i didn't think spirits were real i didn't think any of those things were real and i would say most of these kids like most of y'all don't believe in the spirit realm like you think it's a joke let me just tell you something so since i know y'all like conspiracy theories <laughs> um this isn't a conspiracy theory but i mean whatever you want to believe so pretty much like if you guys go on just honestly go and watch the matrix watch that movie since y'all like movies that movie is going to show you how pretty much the entire world and it isn't to scare you it's just to like y'all need to wake up because a lot of people are asleep like to the world like the government's trying to keep you distracted with like phones and like entertainment and all these things so you guys don't wake up to like real reality and real reality is that the entire world is dominated by spirits so it's like everything is spiritual like the spirit realm is literally like you're talking right now and that's like a spirit like you're a spirit <laughs> and when people are like spirits aren't real i've just been seeing like obviously like kids are so attracted to dark stuff what they don't realize is that if you're attracted to dark stuff it just means that like you probably have spirits attached to you inside of you that are dark as well um and i just don't think people understand this it's like I think it's ignorance and I think it's like you not <coughs> hold on and it's just like when you're a kid you just I say you're a kid when you're like 15 14 16 you don't understand like the real world and like you don't understand life like you think you do but you don't and one thing I realize is just like the world is so much deeper than what people think it is like it's so deep and I just feel like if people don't, if you don't sit down and just analyze certain things like the government, the media, all these things are just pretty much trying to distract you and like take away your like brain power. Like that way you don't have the ability to think for yourself and think and like realize like what is reality in your own eyes, not like what the media tells you. And it's like when it comes to the spiritual realm and all these kind of things, people don't realize that it's more real than the physical world there's practices there's a lot of things that people do and are doing right now that you have no idea about people practicing occultic practices in order to get access to the spirit realm and do a bunch of stuff that you have no idea about because of your own ignorance and what you guys need to understand is that it's not to scare you but like let me tell you something like the dark side exists good the good side exists as well and you're the one who chooses what side you want to be a part of um i believe like nowadays everyone wants to be a part of the dark side because the dark side looks cool <laughs> but that's also an agenda like people don't realize that it's all an agenda to just literally suck you dry of like your spirit like okay like the more you feed the dark side like everything that's trendy is just dark you know what i mean and people don't realize that that's literally what they want you to like feed your dark side to feed the dark this entire system is dark everything about it and if you guys were to like research literally it's just the world we live in it's like a cosmic bubble of darkness all of it it's reigned and governed by dark principalities if you if you don't know what principalities are look it up it's pretty much just darkness so they feed off of you being into dark stuff they love that spiritually they feed off of that they also feed off of people feeling spiritually dead and people being depressed so it's like this entire system is meant to like suck your soul pretty much so this is why it's so important and like people don't give a shit 
But it's like you have to be aware that the spiritual realm exists. Because if you think it doesn't exist, you're just going to be walking around like... The spirit is pretty much like... You can't see your brain, you can't see your mind, but you know it exists. Because like how would you be like watching me right now? So that's the spirit. So the spirit is fed by pretty much like what you watch, what you hear, what you're doing, the activities that you participate in. That's the spirit. So it's like if constantly all you're watching is dark stuff all you're listening to is dark music all like this is the spirit this is what you're allowing inside of you people say it's not that deep it's not that deep until you realize that you you're carrying emotions and perspectives and things inside of your head that aren't even yours like i remember like sometimes i'll i'll just be like feeling something and it's not even my own emotion it's like somebody else's so it's like the universe we live in it's all about energy transfer it's all about spiritual transfers like you literally like have you ever just like everything is, is an exchange like everything is energy everything is spiritual every single thing you talking to someone it's a spiritual exchange because you're exchanging energy if that person is in a bad mood and they're depressed they will transfer that to you you can block it like as in like you know if there's some well i'm gonna be honest there's some people who are actually spiritually dead um usually narcissists they're spiritually dead um so they don't receive they're not empathetic and they don't feel other people's energies because they're so consumed in their own energy um there is a lot of people like that but for people who are i'm gonna say more sensitive like spiritually like they're more like just like aware um you can literally like carry somebody else's mood like have you ever just been with somebody and they're in a bad mood and then you get in a bad mood out of nowhere that's spiritual transfer so that's why it's just so important to be aware be more aware guys like if you're watching me you're probably on tiktok all day consuming a bunch of content that you don't even know what it's doing to your brain y'all like and this isn't to scare you i'm just saying like if you're easily impressionable and especially when you're young and you're like you don't even have like your intellectual capacity to like think for yourself is not you're it's low because at that age when like when i was 15 and 16 everything i watched like when i was young i believed everything i watched and everybody like it felt like the entire world was indoctrinating me and conditioning me mentally to think a certain way so the point is try to think for yourself and form your own ideas about the world and don't let these media sources and all these things teach you how to think like and just be more aware of what you're doing because everything affects you. Every single And last but not least, just try to become aware that you're a spiritual being having a human experience and that the world around you is always gonna wanna make you feel like you, you like you you don't matter or like you're not valuable. And all of that is an